Hi everyone, this is Tina. Thank you for coming by and seeing my videos. I am finally feeling better. Um, I had COVID for two weeks. I still have a little cough and I haven't tested again yet um, to make sure that I was negative, but it was a long road, I'm telling you. It was, um, I think the worst part of it was the body aches. I didn't lose my sense of taste or smell. Um, I had different side effects than my husband because I had gotten it. I tested positive, he was negative, and then two days later he tested again and he was positive. So, um, so I had mostly body aches, headache, um, and fever. And my husband had fever, headaches. Um, he had this uh, real bad stomach ache. Um, and also he had, his skin felt like razor blades, he said. Now, I didn't get that, um, that, you know, side effect, thank God. Neither one of us had too much congestion. Um, so yeah, so I'm starting to feel better today. I decided I need to get caught up. I'm so sorry I haven't done any videos. I haven't done any Saturday morning makes. Um, but I have a pile of stuff here that's been coming in. I want to share with you guys and some cards that I received from my sweet friends here on YouTube. So let's get started. This is probably going to be a part two. This is going to be part one because I have way too much to show in one video. Okay. All right. So let's get this out of the way. This was an Amazon order that I placed. Um, let me get rid of that noisy paper. Okay, so not a big deal. I went to Amazon and I got some more folders. I use these um, Max Tex, Max Tex, I think it says China from China. I don't know. Uh, the DVD sleeves. I use these to put my um, dies and stamps in, and uh, they work very well for me. I think the quality of these are just as uh, good as the Avery L. Um, I used to buy the Avery L and they were got to be a little expensive. So I went to these and the quality is about the same and I get these on, um, Amazon. So I got those and I got the smaller ones. Okay. And they're just, uh, this brand. If you want to look them up on, um, Amazon you could do that. Um, and then I got a couple bottles of, uh, my glue because I was um, getting low or out, pretty much out um, of the art glitter glue. So I bought two of these. And I know they sell bigger bottles. The problem with the bigger bottles for me, because of the arthritis in my hands, I prefer to be able to hold a smaller bottle that works better for me. Um, so I got those. Um, that was Amazon. Here is some Happy Mail that I received. So this comes from D. Elegant Embellishments here on YouTube. And this card is so pretty. She used the Diane Markham new stamp. And I got the digitals um, as well. And then I also ordered um, the cookie jar and the other physical stamps, the clear stamps that she had in her release. And I also signed up for the club. I signed up for the stamp and the extra stamp. I did not go along with the paper. I just thought that the paper even though it matches, it was a little pricey to do all three. So I just did the stamps. Um, I'll use my own paper with that. So, But this card is so pretty, D. I love it. She's got this gingham in the back, the little chicken um, with the recipe, and she sized it down on her computer. She colored it really pretty to match. This paper behind here is really pretty as well. It's got like a, I think it's got like fall flowers or leaves really cute goes with that green gingham and then this lace is so pretty and then she's added these little flowers in the um in the center of the lace very very pretty and this card was just just to wish me uh well and hope that i feel better soon so d thank you thank you so much i love that card and i'm going to sit it right there for a second okay and then i got a card from patty o'malley hi patty thank you so much for the card um, so this one came from Patty. So, so cute. She's got this little bunny wrapped up in a blanket, um, you know, for get well. 
I don't know what dye this is, but this little dye here is beautiful. It's got like little moon shapes and it's got embossing. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that on that layer there, but that is a gorgeous um, die cut patty. She used this cute little tag. It says lots of hugs and a little heart. And she's wrapped it up with some twine. And that's a really nice twine too. I don't know where she got that. That's really thin and very pretty. I love that. Um, and then this background is like an ombre colored background with the uh, orange and peach color. And she's colored the bunny's blanket so cute. Look how cute he is. Just adorable. And then she's just wishing me well as, um, as you know, well as D. So thank you so much, ladies. And then I received um, this package from Rhonda Coleman. Hi, Rhonda. So let me just push it over here for a second. Uh, but I don't want to show nobody's address. Um, but she has decorated the envelope up. Look at this. The envelope's all decorated. Isn't that cute? And it has this cute little washi tape with the cats. So um, that's from Rhonda. And here's the card. And Rhonda has colored up this cute, adorable little melon girl. That's, um, I think that's a Dots or a JRL. It could be JRL. And she's made this cute little watermelon lady there with the little patches on her dress. So cute. And um, the polka dot oval with the stitching in it. And then she just stressed the outside of the car with the little stickers. So cute. Thank you so much, Rhonda. And then inside, Rhonda also wrote me a long letter and a thinking of you. So thank you so much, Rhonda, for thinking of me. And then Rhonda also um, made, she was making these little journals. And I had commented and she said she wanted to send me one. But this is so neat. Um, she used a lot of the antique, old, like, um, um, patterns and stuff like that and she's got little buttons down here on this little piece of material she's um sewn this with a put a stitch in it to fit up here like the you know like it's a curtain and oh my gosh this book is amazing thank you so much Rhonda there's so many old papers and uh newspapers she's added cotton uh ribbon uh lace she's stamped in it Look at this. Isn't this awesome? Another little piece of cotton trim. And then she's got like a material piece here. And this little paper that you can, uh, what do they call this paper? Like grid, grid paper. And she's done some stamping here with a sewing machine and some thread spools. Some button stamps at the top. Some more patterns. This is so cool, Rhonda. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. And um, in her note, look at the little scissors she punched. And it looks like she um, distressed the ink, I mean the paper. It's crinkly and it's got like coffee stain. It's so neat. This one has little material and buttons. There's some music paper in there. It's so cool. I love this. Thank you so much, Rhonda, again, um, for doing this. And look at this little piece of ribbon. It's like a ruler. Or measuring tape so she's done a really good job here on this uh, notebook or journal I love it Rhonda look at this the buttons and hearts and a thimble that's really cute some more thimble stamping some more coffee stained paper If you go over, I'll leave these ladies' uh, channel links down below. If you go over to Rhonda's, Rhonda's channel, if you don't know Rhonda, subscribe to her and show her some love and see her other journals that she made. So this is so cool. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it, Rhonda. That was very nice of you. And please go over and see Dee, who is embellishments, um, uh, elegant embellishments I think it is and then Patty O'Malley please go visit all these ladies I'll leave the links down below they are all very talented and um, you will love the content on their channel so thank you ladies
And I'm so glad that um, I am finally feeling better. And these cards just really made my day. Each time I got a card in the mail, it was so awesome. Um, okay, so let's see. This I think this is the CC Designs order that I placed. Let me get rid of these envelopes. Yeah, this was the CC Designs. On Mother's Day, they had a sale. And most of these stamps were $5. So I had, uh, and some were even $2.50. The smaller ones were $2.50 and $5. And this was on Mother's Day. So I picked up uh, this one here. And I've had her before and I de-stashed her. And because she was only $2.50, I, I got her again. So this one here is the To The Market Swissy. And this one here was $2.50. And this was called Dot. And this one was $2.50, and this is called um, To the Shops Swissy, and she's shopping. Um, this was $5, and these are the banners. And this one here was uh, $5, and this is called Snowman Kids. This was $5, and this is Swissy Fairies. And this one was $5, and this is Autumn. So these were the CC Designs that I picked up on Mother's Day um, for their sale. So I got those. Um, this was an I.O. order. Yeah, this is I.O. And when they when I placed this order, they had forgot a, a stamp. And they um, I contacted them and they sent me the stamp that they missed. And then when they did that, I also placed an order, another order, and got a few more things. So alright. So this was my original order. And I had picked up um, some more stamps that, because they're not going to have them anymore. The end of last month was the end of their ru red rubber, which is, makes me really sad. But I did pick up a few pay, um, stamps that I've been wanting that have been on my wish list. So this is Elisa Baker Impressions. And this is the little bear in the dress. Very primitive. Um, the bunny. Now, I think I have another one of these bunnies that was gifted to me. I'm not sure. I have to go check. I think it was the same type of bunny. If it's different, I'll keep it. If not, I'll pass it along. But I got this one. I got the, um, this is the Autumn. She's got a pumpkin and a little cat. I think she was either the Autumn or the Halloween. I can't remember. It's H20112, but it's not going to matter because they're not doing them anymore. And then I got the little bunny with the um, flowers on its head. I think um, Jill or Anna, somebody had this one and did a um, project with it. It's, go, it's called, it's by, the design is by Gail Green. These are Lisa Baker. Okay. And then I got the French script, and this is the script that Anna always uses on her cards. And um, I wanted to grab it before I couldn't get it anymore. And this was Elisa Baker, and it's the French French script. And then I got this little um, saying, and this is Elisa Baker, and it says, The heart is most happy creating from the, a spirit of love. So the heart is most happy creating from a, from a spirit of love. I love that. Okay, and then this was the stamp they had forgot in my order. And then I contacted them and they sent it right real quick. They sent it to me. And thank you so much, I.O., for doing that. Um, and this is um, the teapot with the gingerbread, the candy canes, the cinnamon sticks, and the poinsettia. And the little berries are in there. It's so pretty. And it's a really nice size. Look at that. That's a really nice size. And this was designed by Tara Coldwell. So I was happy to get that um, after, you know, they missed it. 
no big deal because they had so many orders because of the end of the month sale being over and it took a long time and I did talk to them and they said please to forgive them and I'm I'm you know they were quick to send that right off and no problem so I was happy um this is a I saw Jill create a project with this and I wanted to grab this dye this is a Anna Anna White's dye oh excuse me um and this is the large baked baked bread and Jill made a project using just the pan so you have the pan there and you could do the bread and then it has a little tag and that's a really good size so I grabbed that and then this is um, by Anna White as well and these are the bowls soup bowls I wish the bowls were just a little bit bigger than they are but that's okay um, there they are I think it's still a good size to put stuff in and put on your cards. So I got that. And then I got this little basket was on clearance. And I saw someone, I can't remember who it was, create something with this little basket. And I, it was so cute. And I was like, if I could find that basket, I'll grab it. And so I did find it. And it's in the clearance section. I'm not sure if you can see the pattern. I'll have to stamp it out maybe but it's a really cute little basket and then I got this saying and this is um it says bless your heart on it so and these are I O. Oh. all right so that is what I have for you in this video I'm gonna move this stuff and put this away and then I'm gonna come back and I got a lot of wood stamps that have been coming in from eBay and I went to a yard sale yesterday and I picked up some stamps wood stamps and also I have a scrapbook.com but I'll come back and do another video in just a few thank you so much for watching god bless and we'll see you next time bye everybody